Do you wish Mike Pence were here? That would be amazing. <laughs> would you wish he would say more, speak out more? I do. I mean, there's no one else uh, that has lived what Donald Trump and the danger that he is, that he poses more than him. I have seen him in very uh, moments of crisis where he had to navigate how we were going to handle Donald Trump and how we were going to not let him derail things that we were trying to do when we were trying to help the American people, especially during times of COVID. Again, in, in mass shooting situations that were actually hate crimes and domestic terrorism here that I had to cover because I was, yeah. you know, I covered that portfolio and how we had to carefully navigate. How do you message in a moment where that requires true leadership to the American people while also countering the fact that it's the person sitting in the Oval Office of that, at the time who's actually driving some of the hate crimes and some of these incidents that are happening in the country by the rhetoric that he's using and by the rhetoric that a lot of these more far-right Republican leaders are using, and they're still using it today. 